Well, that's after about an hour or so. The uh, girls have definitely found it. You can see there's no drowning though. I mean, it's, it's a pretty effective design, but um, yeah, you, you'll see when more and more come, they'll, they'll start fighting. So um, one of the reasons why open feeding is not a good idea. We'll come back in a bit anyways, and I'll show you when it's really humming in, and we'll go from there. Back again, as you can see, <laughs> they've all found it. Um, they're sucking away pretty quick, smart. If you have a look at this one where the label's tilted around, wait for it, <laughs> and they're sucking it so fast, you can actually see, look, see the bubbles coming up. Wait for it again. They love the stuff. But, if you can look, you can see the problem with bulk feeding. For starters, it, it you know can encourage the spread of disease and all that sort of stuff, but, the biggest problem you're going to have, you see down there, see how they're all down the bottom there, there's no actual syrup down there, they're just having a fight. So they're going to fight over who gets the syrup and whatnot, and um, yeah, you do end up with a lot of casualties doing it this way. It's okay sometimes, um, but for the most part, internal feeding's better. Whoa, you're getting cranky with me. Sign off, I'm not doing it down there. 